Hi and welcome to this tutorial. Here I'm going to show you how to use an Excel macro in order to open up another workbook on your computer. Then I'm going to show you how to use um, the same method I'm going to show you to open up multiple workbooks at the same time. And if you'd like to get this workbook and the macro you're about to see, go to teachexcel.com, search for this video tutorial, and you can download the workbook. The macro will be located within it. So I'm going to be using two keyboard shortcuts here, one for the VBA window, Alt F11, and one to view macros, Alt F8. Pretty standard stuff. It's going to work on um, <clears throat> pretty much all Excel versions. So let's go ahead and begin. Now what I want to do, like I said, is use a workbook, or use a macro to open up another workbook. So let's hit Alt F11 to uh, go to the VBA window and start creating our macro. Select the desired workbook, go to Insert Module, you will see this window. Let's go ahead and name our macro. Simply open workbook. And let's begin. You're going to see just how easy it is to do this. So all you have to do is type workbooks.open. See the open starts to fill in. Space. Now when you hit space, you're going to see that open, the dot open thing right here, has all of these arguments that you could use with it the file name, then you could choose to update the links of the file, make it read-only, change format, uh, have a password for that. So you can do a lot of different things. And I'll show you how to do those in different tutorials. For this one, I'm going to show you basic open up a workbook. So now what we want are two quotation marks. Go in between the quotation marks, and all we have to do now is to type the file path of the file which we would like to open. In this case, another Excel workbook. So what we want to do is to start on the C drive by default it's going to be C drive so C colon backslash and for me I have um, the files I'm going to be referencing simply located just right on the hard drive so let me go ahead and copy that name in just like that so the file that I want to open is called import CSV file with Excel and uh, this is actually a file for one of the tutorials that I gave previously but this is really all you have to do. Now let me um, just say that if I were to have this file called import CSV file with Excel in different folders within my hard drive, simply type them like this. Folder 1, Folder 2, Folder 3, etc. So I could have C, project files, um, testing, I don't know, whatever. You could name all of these folders, and then this would be where the file is located in folder 3. Also, it is, um, I guess you could say, considered good practice to include the file extensions. This would be a .xlsx file. However, as you will see, it's not entirely necessary to do so. So let's go ahead and run this and see how it works exactly. So I'm going to hit Alt F11 to close this window and Alt F8 to open up the view macro window. Open workbook, there's our macro, so let's click run. And I forgot to take the uh, test folders off. So my file is not located in any of these folders. And that's what it looks like if you do it incorrectly. So this is where my file is located. It's correct file path. Let's go ahead and run this again. Alt F8, run and there we go it opens up the workbook you can see at the top import CSV file with Excel so let's go ahead and close this and the next thing I'm going to show you is how to open up multiple workbooks at once pretty easy to do it is the exact same process in fact workbooks dot open space quotation mark and now we want to put the file path of the next file in here and I'm going to copy and paste the name in, just like that. So we first want to open up the import CSV file with Excel file, and then open up this VBA Excel file. So I'm going to hit Alt F11 to close this, and Alt F8. Now let's run the macro. So you see this is the second file that was opened. You can see at the top VBA 13 cells, property introduction, close this, and you see the first ma or the first um, Excel file that was opened right here. So that's how you can open up multiple files in Excel um, using a macro. 
Now when I hit Alt F11, let's go back here and just take a look at everything. So this is the syntax for it. It's really simple and easy to do and like I said you can do some really cool things with um, the uh, workbooks.open method and I'll show you how to do that in later tutorials. Now if you'd like to get this workbook and uh, these little macros here, go to teachexcel.com, search for the video tutorial and you can download it there. That's it for this tutorial.